Welcome to Herald of Glory Devotional. Today, Wednesday, July 8, 2020. Theme, Get to Know Him. Philippians chapter 3, verse 10, King James Version. That I may know Him and the power of His resurrection and the fellowship of His sufferings being made conformable unto His death. One distinctive trait of the early apostles was their knowledge of Jesus. It was not merely because they were born in the time he lived, but much more, they sought to know him even after his departure through the Holy Spirit. They lived for the cause of knowing their Lord and serving him with their whole lives. Their understanding is clear in the way they related with the Lord Jesus. Once, Jesus said to them, Henceforth I call you not servants, for the servant knoweth not what his Lord doeth, but I have called you friends, for all things that I have heard of my Father I have made known unto you. John chapter 15 verse 15, King James Version. The disciples had become increasingly acquainted with their master. Acts chapter 4 verse 13 testifies that now when they, the leaders of the Jews, saw the boldness of Peter and John and perceived that they were unlearned and ignorant men, they marveled and they took knowledge of them that they had been with Jesus. When you encountered them, you knew that they had been with Jesus. Their mere mannerism gave them up. Likewise, the Lord is calling you to that place of intimacy with Him. He's calling you to know Him more and more through the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit makes the fellowship of Christ a reality. He makes the presence and knowledge of Jesus tangible in you. There is no limit to knowing the Lord Jesus through the Holy Spirit. What is your present knowledge and intimacy with the Lord Jesus? Get to know Him the more. For the Apostle Paul, the excellency of the knowledge of Christ, his Lord was worth trading everything for. How have you prized your intimacy with the Lord? It must be nothing less than the priority of your daily living. Spend quality time to fellowship with the Lord every day and avoid every distraction in your quiet times with the Lord. Always put your phone away when fellowshipping with the Lord and avoid every distraction. Learn of the Lord in the scriptures and always maintain a fresh desire to know Him more. Your intimate knowledge of the Lord is the proximate element for your fruitful Christian living and service. Declaration. Please declare. Thank you, dear Lord God Jesus for the special place of fellowship you have called me into. As I study the scriptures, I see you and model you. I follow and want to know you more day by day. Through fellowship with the Holy Spirit, I increase in my knowledge of you. Hallelujah. Further study, 1 John chapter 1, verse 1 and 3, that which was from the beginning, which we have heard, which we have seen with our eyes, which we have looked upon and our hands have handled of the word of life, that which we have seen and heard declare we unto you, that ye also may have fellowship with us, and truly our fellowship is with the Father and with his Son, Jesus Christ. One year Bible reading, Psalm 120 to 125. Pastor Julius Glorifield Christ Lord, heralding the glorious church, to receive free hard copy prints of the devotional or to be a partner, kindly contact plus 233-555-500-100 plus 233-555-500-100. Follow, like and share Herald of Glory on Facebook and Instagram daily. Facebook, Herald of Glory. Instagram, Herald of Glory. Enjoy a perfect day. You are blessed.